Hello once again, Internet. I am, as ever, your Master of Ceremonies, Mr. Nibs. And today we are going to be taking a little look at a game called Space Marine, which is based off Games Workshop's beautiful tabletop strategy game, Warhammer 40k, where you play as big burly dudes shooting lots of other big burly dudes, or lift less burly dudes in the case of the Eldar, uh, to try and, well, kill the other dude. So, so today, this is the Space Marines versus the Orcs, green little buggers who seem to be dying quite horribly. Now, this, if you've played this game, it might look a little different to what you're used to, because I've modified it slightly. Usually you play as the Smurfs, the Ultramarines. They are blue, they are bland, they are depressingly boring. So I've switched, switched that. Come on, mouth, you can do this. So I've swapped him out for the Death Watch, which are alien killers. And he's also a Space Marine captain, so it annoyed me whenever you started the game that you would always have... Um, you always started with a bolt pistol and a combat knife. You're a goddamn captain, and you start off with the basic gear of a noob. So I've modded him. Now he has a Storm Bolter, as standard, a Jump Pack, and he will have, in a few minutes, a Power Axe. I will splice in a picture, uh, or probably on the left side, uh, you might be able to see it now, where you'll see what this dude, Captain Titus, what he looks like without any mods. You will probably agree that he looks kind of shitty for a captain. Anyway, that's enough waffling from me, let's get into the game. And here we are in the game. This is Space Marine, rather dingy, wouldn't you agree? That is because the world is, the universe, in, in fact, is in a very poor state of affairs. These dudes are pretty damn large. Anyway, we are Captain Titus. Away! <laughs> oh, I know I shouldn't have this, but it's so much fun. And here is the Power Axe. Da, 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 da. Just to finish everything up. Oh, thank you for the tutorial. It is so much fun to use this thing. Swingy, swingy. Oh, so I've got to go hit. Oh, have I broke this already? Up. Oh. Up. Oh, okay. There we go. Let's start this. Let's start this off right. We're here now. Um. Oh. Oh, that's not a good noise. What's on fire? An entire horde. Oh. Look. If it's an entire horde, we are fucked. Yeah. <laughs> This game gives you such a beautiful feeling of just raw, unearthly power. Die! Die! <laughs> we are the fucking space breeds, and we will turn you into mulch. You green little shit. Technically, we are turning you into mulch because... <laughs> That's right, clip through the boxes as I turn your face into pulp. Oh god. I want to talk more about the game, but it's kind of hard to concentrate. When at the moment you're trying not to die. And for once you don't have um, AI companions that are shitty. As you'll see at the top, I have a shield thingamajig and a health bar at the bottom. But you don't regain health in the normal sense. No, you regain it by doing this. Health! Health doom! Your face! Thanks for the life! I don't know how that works. Maybe your blood somehow helps me. But maybe it doesn't. This game doesn't really have much time for logic. It is just ball to the wall, brutal pain, and that fucker is shooting at me. You're poor. You're poor. Now you are holy. Come on. Must kill more green fucks. Yeah, stop hitting me. Stop hit. Am I getting shot at by my own friends? Oh, no, wait. It was you. Okay. Oh, no, wait. Oh. I didn't get to fulfill his final wish of being shot at again. I feel dismayed, horribly, horribly dismayed, but it doesn't matter because I'm, well, this game is just so damn cathartic. Nothing else really comes close because, well, in what game can you do this? Your face, your kidneys, your liver, that is if you even have them because the orcs are descended from plants. Literally. Yeah. Come to the slaughter. Boop to the face. We are the Death Watch. We are the arms militant of the Ordo Xenos, and we will purge the orcs. Mm. Skin tingles. Oh, that's a big belly fuck. Ah, what the? Um, okay. 
I don't think this game likes me doing that. Must... Yeah, I don't really want to be in the way of those knobs. Yes, they are called knobs. Reload already. Thank Ow. But... Death from above. Oh, I missed. I'm not a very... I've not... I wear glasses in real life. My aiming is very poor. My aiming is very poor. I am not going to... No, oh, Jesus. Oh, can you see what I mean when this when I say this game is just absolutely amazing? Oh, Jesus, I am I am really not doing all that. Well, give me health! Give me health! Thank you. Oh, God, that was fucking close. Die, die. Oh, God, I hate these fucks. Come on, just... Ah! Sorry, it's hard to commentate at the same time while getting shot at by the... Ah, there we go. Oh. Okay, so the prompt's still there, but the dude is dead. That's actually slightly disappointing. I wanted to kill him. Where are the guardsmen? You fuckers took away my kill! My lord, we have word that an inquisitor is in the manufactory. Ooh, ominous. Yes, honest. Lord Drogon. We have not seen him Sounds for like a kind days. of alcoholic beverage. Has the Just look at how fucking arrived, big these lord. dudes are! They're like seven foot tall. The ultramarines are here as a vanguard. Cripple the enemy. No, the Smurfs aren't here. I am Death Watch. But the facility and its titans remain. I apparently secure. am Death Watch of the Imperial no Fists. He is of the Ultramarines, Contact and my friend over here is in Hab Center Andres. Crimson Fists? I don't know. Anyway, what the stop talking. They did not survive. I don't need dialogue, I just need slaughter. These dudes Oi, can run pretty damn clean, fast, guardsmen. even though they're in ginormous oh, armor. My thanks, oh. Oh, lovely, audio logs. That's kind of creepy. Yes, they turn dead people into flying skulls which act as, like, intermediaries. Yeah, I can't be bothered to listen to that. Inquisitor Drogon had five of those things flying around him? Handy. Okay, so you have seen my... This is actually trying to be based off my actual Space Marine Captain in real life, but I can't, um, I can't get the color scheme to work right. Ooh, spooky. <laughs> okay, so we have... Oh, wait, shit. Since I'm using the jump pack, I am limited to these two weapons, which is a little disappointing. But, well, I don't care. I have a fucking jump pack, even though it's mute. It has no sound. Oh yes, earlier we dropped a dread, uh, no not a dread, not a Titan's plasma cannon onto them. It didn't explode with as much force as I expected. Anyway, back to the weapons. I only have these two weapons because I am using the jump pack. It could be worse. Usually I would have a stalker bolter, which is like um, this game's version of a sniper rifle. And I had uh, a melter gun, which essentially fires out a wave of pure molten hatred at whatever poor bastard is in the way. It's essentially a pl it's it's a lava plasma shotgun thingamajig. No, I I know that doesn't make much sense, but I don't care. Oh god, I'm just so glad we're not the Smurfs. I don't get why they're so popular. And really, why are they all using regular bolters? Should, he's a heavy weapon specialist. He should be having a heavy bolter, a las cannon, a plasma cannon, or something more juicy. And he is, well, actually, he's a noob, so that's okay for him to have that. Titan Invictus seems undamaged at least. Ooh, pretty. Fucking hell, man. Yeah, who cares? Get that many in there. Get that many people in that goddamn Titan. I mean, look at it. Look at it. It's got so many guns. So many guns. And what appears to be... Oh, it's undressed. It's a naked titan. It needs clothing. That's why it's not been activated. It's shy. It doesn't want to come outside and let everybody see it's robo-bollocks. There, I have now castrated you. You may thank me later. Because now you can go outside sounding like a castrato. And never having to worry about people, well... Staring at your googlies. Augur station. Couldn't they just say control panel or some shit like that? Oh, you look like you're having a wonderful time. Is that a skull that's talking? 
If I was there, that would be quite, quite weird. Oh, good. More stuff to kill. Oh, that Inquisitor's not going to survive very long. Also, I don't know how long I've been recording for. Quite a while, I would assume. And I, I just want to keep going, because this game is so much fun. Whee! 100%, really. Wow, that's a lot of dead people. Considering this planet, entire planet is a forge world, that's a lot of dead people. Also, this place actually looks rather nice. I mean, it's bright outside and lovely. Even though this is a forge world and all they do is belch horrible chemicals into the sky, I need to stop jumping around. Because if I hold down the button, even though it's mute, and I fly too far out because of the mod, well, the game will just go, Fuck you, you're going to fall through the world! Uh, I can't remember if I'm recording this in stereo or mono. <coughs> if I'm recording it in stereo, it will be very weird because then you'll be able to hear the sound of rrr, 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 from speaker to speaker. It'd be like it's running through inside your head. That would be very weird indeed. Ah, the symbol of the Mechanicus. Crazy bastards who want to turn everything into yes. metal. Can you use this panel to contact our other forces? Please do. Uh, wait a minute, we don't need other forces. We can do it ourselves. Come on. Thank you. Wow, levers? We're not ultramarines with Death Watch. Huh? Oh, Here, good Captain. grief! Ultramarines. This is Captain Titus. Are you no. receiving? No. Death Watch. Captain, this is Sergeant Midas. Squad Solid. Midas? Is Does everything you touch turn into gold? New you have a fancy ass little gun that shoots golden bullets. Bangity bangity bang. the Titan Invictus. I need Solinus to come secure the Invictus while I divert to a priority alarm. On our way. Captain. I can't actually remember Midas what the priority out. alarm is. Oh well. Not my problem. I'm just here to cathartically turn enemies into paste. They're never going to actually be able to get rid of the orcs, because when the orcs die, they release spores into the atmosphere, and they literally grow. So, this planet's kind of fucked, either way. They're going to have to glass it. But while we're here, we can at least have some fun. That's a really disorganized conveyor belt. I mean, just look at it. Can they at least print it out in, like, nice, neat little areas? But no, it's basically machines like, ka-chunk, ka-chunk, ka-chunk. <laughs> what the fuck? The orcs are in the pipes. Can we just flood them with metal or steam or some shit? Hello! No, you're not getting away. Stop running! You're supposed to be orcs. Stand and fight and die. Ah, Gretchen. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Die! Oh, lovely. It's a fucking clown car. They're just appearing out of the ether. <laughs> I think the door just turned and smushed. Wait a minute. All my bolter shots up there didn't kill it? Okay, I'm going to uh, actually try and talk about gameplay at the moment. Uh, this game is uh, a third-person shooter, obviously. It's very, very action-oriented. Uh, based around melee combat, which is slicey, 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 crunchy, dead. And range gunplay. Ammo is rather scarce, to be honest, but that just adds to the tension, apart from your, you know, your pistol. And the guns sound amazing. I played Dawn of War and the guns in that sounded kind of anemic. It was like, pew, 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 pew. whereas in this, it's like, I am firing the fury of God at you! Yeah, that sounds, it makes you feel like a badass. <coughs> Even the standard bolter sounds good. I've heard some people, they complain about the fact that the bolter uh, doesn't fire fast enough or that its ammo capacity is too low. That's because bolter rounds, they're, you're essentially firing miniature rockets at the enemy. They are self-propelled mass reactive explosives. They lodge inside the enemy and, well, splooge. Oh, come on, slow elevators. You'd think with all this shit going on around here, this crazy ass kinds of armor, they'd be able to make an elevator move at least a little bit faster. Also, the void. The void with poor texturing. <laughs> or am I just staring at the floor there? I cannot tell, it's too dark. Was that it? We're not even going back up? We don't know what's up there! It's a mystery forevermore. I feel sad now that I won't know. Oh, great! We're Death Watch. You should love us. 
immediate release. You Weapon should really love us. Oh, shut up. Hello, Drogon. Have you tried turning it off and then on again? Evidently not. Hello. I am Drogon. Wow, with all those extra bits, you must be a laugh to go with into the airport. Just But you seem to have weathered the enemy's attack. Not very well. I am soldier and scientist, both, Captain. We'll put that to the test. The experimental device. The power source. Oh, so that's what it is. Entire manufacturum from the generator room. Damn. This device is a fuel source, not a weapon. Huh? It is a complex device and an unstable one. Oh, lovely. We're sitting on top of high explosives. It, apart. it could detonate with enough force to destroy the entire planet. Use it! I want to see what happens! Safety. Please! I want to see everybody die! Reason, I need your aid. You have our aid. We are the fucking Death Watch. We are well, part we of the Ordo Xenos. I'm a psycho. Oh, great. My psychic abilities are controlling the bleeding. Very well. That makes a... Actually, that does kind of make a whole lot of sense. Please don't kill us and turn into a demon and then try to, uh, well, make us all your little playthings. Actually, if you're a demon of Slaneshi, that should be interesting. Ooh, cutscene. Stompy, stompy, stompy. Hi. You wouldn't even know how to use one. You can have a hard time of that, I think. Not if I do it to you first! Hello! It doesn't have to actually be a spike with any sort of pointy implement. Fuck you! Oh, you're gonna have a hard time doing that, matey. <coughs> Man, I need to stop being so fucking awesome! It's causing me to die! Fuck you! Oh, he's dead. Aww. I wanted to turn him into paste. Oh well. Whee! Fuck. This is what this is how you play the game. You just wade right in and turn everything into mulch. Feel the mighty boot! Mighty boot right up in your face. Zoom. Zoom. I never understood how power weapons work. I'm assuming it's through some sort of small power source, but. Surely you'd run out by now due to the fact that you're just cleaving through everything. Oh, I shot him in the testicles, I think. I mean, actually, that's a point. Do orcs have testicles? Orc biology 101. Orcs have testicles. Thank you for that. I thought they reproduced through spores. Do they just go wankity wankity wank? I don't smell much. Come on, I wear power armor. The only way the scent can get out is through my neck. And even that is properly banged up. Ooh. New toys, new toys, new toys, new toys, new toys. What do we get? Swap Storm Bolter for Storm Bolter. No, I've not unlocked the plasma bit. Yeah, that's a point. At this point, you would have unlocked a plasma pistol, but... Uh, oh, good. Uh. That does not fill me with hope. I saw a lot of sparks. Right. How do we get up there? How? Oh, how? Oh, how? Oh. Okay, so it wasn't actually anything that could kill us. It was just literally sparks. Um, yeah, none of you saw that. None of you saw me attack that. None of you saw me do that. Die, die. I give you the Emperor's peace. Apparently they're immune to my attempts at giving them peace and hope. Oh, another cutscene. Whoa! My boys want to give you a proper greeting. Who do the voodoo that you do, matey? Yeah. Wah! Okay. Hello. Uh, no! Wait a minute. I'm firing fucking rockets at him, and they're not going through his shield. There we go.
bit of a bit of a weird little bug. I love it clipping through shit. You just get to see what happens. Whee! Did they not even bother to render up there? Wee! Oh, wait, what? <coughs> ah, the perils of using a jump pack in such a way. And suddenly all momentum is lost as I get slowed down to a crawl. Come on, I want to move already. Thank you. Brothers, guard the access points. Where are they? Right. So that's an access point, is it? Oh no, wait, that's a Drogon, isn't it? You must keep the chamber secure until the power source is exposed. I don't want to be flashed out by whatever the hell that is. Come on. Whoa. Oh, come on. That's just lazy. They just stuck it through the ceiling. Oh. Alarm. Yes, very alarming, is it not? Hello! Come on, Dart, take my bullets to Dart. Whoa, whoa. Captain, the war boss. Let me kill him, I put bullets in his face. Oh shit. Bad. This is a bad place to be. <coughs> I'll try my best. Fuck you all. Fuck you. Fuck you. I'm going to want that back! Thank you! That's um that was very nice of you to give it back to me. Even though you really have a choice in the matter. Fuck you, squishies. Come on, die already! I've put so many bullets into you, you should have fallen over due to the sheer weight of said bullets. Oh. I'm not running anywhere, I have nowhere to run to, and besides the space marines don't run. Oh, Fuck! It will retrieve the power source and get it into its canister. Oh, good grief. Can they stop throwing people at me right now? Or at least form an orderly queue? Come on, I'm English. I expect queues. I expect orderly queues. Line up for your murder facing. One murder facing, please. Murder facing has been achieved. Now, who else wants murder facing? It's a discount today. Murder facings for all. Just so long as you form an orderly queue. That is all I require of you. Anger. It's so not right. Yes, it is. You can't have the sparky thing. Aww. That robot looks so sad now. It didn't expect to be destroyed in such a, well, pathetic manner. Hello. Stab. Stab. Um, that seems like a very bad idea. This is not wise. That thing is not healthy. Ugh. Did I died? Come on. Live, please. There's still game to play. Oh, you're awake. And that thing doesn't exactly look that deadly, although the most innocuous things are usually the most destructive. Ooh, a magnet. And we shall call it a day there. Ladies and gentlemen, shut up, please. Shut up. Inquisitor insisted you could not have survived. No, I survived quite well. Shut up, I want to finish the video. We set a rendezvous in Hap Center Andres. Good. These tunnels will you can go there, there and lie down once I'm done. Fine. Continue heading toward the Hab Center. Okay, thank you. Right then, Internet, this has been my little playthrough of Space Marine on the PC. I suggest you go and pick it up whenever you can. Uh, I think it's about 20 quid on Steam. And, oh, good grief, it is such a beautiful game. I leave you for now with, well... Nothing. This. Goodbye!